Chewy, what hey. are you up to? Hey, and somebody, oh, um, this is this really famous physics problem. It's a monkey on a tree, on a branch, and then there's a shooter here with a, with a gun that's gonna shoot the bullet and kill, try to shoot the monkey. But, yeah, I know. But anyway, the idea is that when the monkey hears the gunshot, it's gonna drop from the branch. And so the question is, is the hunter gonna succeed in shooting the monkey in this setup? What do you think? Um, okay, let's think first of the case where there is no gravity. So, no gravity, of course, when the monkey starts falling, it's just gonna hang in there, right? Yeah. And the bullet, on the other hand, will just go through the monkey's heart. That's not very nice. <laughs> okay, now let's add gravity. What happens? When we have gravity, the monkey starts falling, but at the same time, the bullet also falls. And the thing is, they both fall at the same rate for the same time. Okay, you think it, you think they're gonna be at the same rate at the same time? I guess, yeah, you can, I, you can see this from the equation, I think, right? Let me try to write the equation. Uh, I think sometime an equation is good. So I'm gonna write y final, y initial, vi y delta t minus g over 2 times delta t squared. So y final equal y initial plus v initial y delta t minus g over 2 delta t squared. That's the piece that's coming from gravity. So if there's no gravity, it's just essentially going in a straight line. But if there's gravity, it's going to fall like this amount. And I guess you're saying, well, the monkey is also going to fall by this amount. Exactly. It's a free fall. So even if you look at the monkeys falling by exactly the same amount in the same amount of time. Okay. Yeah. Well, tell me, uh, I don't really like this problem because you're shooting at a monkey. Come yeah, on. I know, I know. I mean, most textbooks nowadays have changed this to a coconut. Coconut. Yeah, but you know, why would a coconut just suddenly fall when you shoot it? This kind of makes sense. It makes no sense. In the physics department, we decided instead to shoot Kenny. Kenny? Yeah, from South Park. Come and see. I'll show you. Here, Hensley. Get back to Bow. Yeah, this is Kenny. Physics department, Kenny. So, um, you know, from South Park, if you're a bit young, you probably know. So, we can't kill Monkey, that's bad, but Kenny, he deserves it. Poor Kenny. Yeah, he's just gonna have to go. So, here's a big cannon. Throws a basketball, so let's just put that in there. And then the idea is I'm gonna put Kenny up all the way up there, I'm gonna aim it right at him, and then we're gonna shoot it. But, uh, how can you make sure that? Kenny's gonna drop when the basketball is launched. Oh yeah, we have a nice system for that. Look at this. So I'm gonna hang Kenny with this electromagnet. Right now it's not working. What I do as I arm it, push the button, it's labeled arm, <laughs> here. Now it's armed, now I have a Kenny here. It holds, oh. like if you hold, hold it here. See now Kenny is holding up. I'm gonna raise it up there. But the idea is when the basketball is gonna launch, just at the moment it comes out, it's gonna trigger this laser beam which is going to oh, wow. drop Kenny. Yeah. And then Kenny is going to drop just in the moment the basketball is launched. And the question is, will we shoot Kenny or is he going to finish this episode alive? Either way, poor Kenny. 